Hi, everyone. Ronnie Rowe back again this week for another um, session of Ronnie Rowe Designs. So, um, this is uh, November the 30th right now, and um, one more day before the Christmas uh, month. I hope each and every one of you had a wonderful Thanksgiving week. Um, hope you got a lot of good food. Uh, got time to spend a lot of time with family like I did. I had my son come in, my daughter, grandkids, and uh, now they're all going back home, and it's the wife and myself. So we're back to normal, I guess you'd call that normal. <laughs> well, anyway, we had a great Thanksgiving, and hope you did as well. Um, not a lot tonight. Some things I like to go over. I wrote a few things today uh, down. Um, I had, uh, like I say, we're going through uh, morning light, and uh, I want to also, oh, before we get any further, Please, by all means, if you are watching this video, I would appreciate it very much if you hit the subscribe button. That would help me out immensely, and I really would appreciate it. And again, like we've said for the last several weeks on Morning Light, shoot me a email and asking for the free pattern, and I'll send you a free PDF file so that you can stitch along with this and. Um, Maybe uh, if you haven't started, get started with it. Or if, you or if you're not going to do it, you still got a free pattern. So anyway, that's um, what we're going to get into a little bit. And I got a few questions this week that uh, people had wanted to know about. Um, but before we do the question, before we do that, let's go to morning light. I've been stitching, didn't get a lot done, but did get some done. And this week, um, what I did, I took it out of the hoop. That's kind of hard to see. And I put my piece of material on a board so you can see where I am on morning light. So this is where I am right now on morning light. As you can see up here, this side is the left-hand side and the sky coming across. And this is the light that's going to come down on the building down here. And uh, along in the middle here would be the pathway down at the bottom here. It's going back into the woods, if you will. Um, going to have a wood pile sitting over here. And uh, you just can't make out the top of the building right here. This is the top of the shed. So with the light coming down on the roof. So we're getting there. So I don't have much more to go on this side right in here. I got a couple more squares in there to do. Then we'll go back and start on this side over here and continue on with this. But this will be morning light. Um, once we finish this design, I'll finish this design. I'm um, going to go out and pick the mat board up. I built the frame already. I've got the frame all, all built. I'll get the mat board, select some col colors, glass, and I'm planning on showing you how we're going to put all that together. Uh, so that is morning light. Uh, again, send me an email and you'll get a free free uh, pattern, a PDF file of this particular design. Um, what I'm working on right now, I've been working on, I told you last week that I wanted to do something with some mountains and the water. I liked what happened with uh, the last couple ones I did, and that was snowbound. That was the boat in the harbor with snowy looking trees in the background and Mystic Harbor. And Mystic Harbor was one I did that um, I really enjoyed also. That was a boat. Uh, let me show you if I can. No, I don't have it. Yes, I do. Bear with me one second. And that is Mystic Harbor. And we'll do something with piers in the, in the background. So anyway, that's that's that turned out pretty good. I like I like that type of scene scenery. So anyway, I've got something in the works on that, and I'm hoping to be sharing that with you very soon. Um, to show you the sketches that I've done and how we're going to get going, rolling on that the same way we did with uh, Morning Light. Um, one of the questions I got this week was, a lady wanted to know if I could take one of my existing patterns that I have put out there and make it pen and ink, black and white. And uh, the simple answer to that is no. <laughs> And the reason why is because, like morning light and a lot of my patterns, to do a pen and ink design, it's almost like watercolor, if you think of it, where the 
paper itself is part of the design and the black and whites the fabric is part of the design so in order for me to uh, do that you have to go through and redesign it a different way to put a lot of light on it take out a lot of stuff uh, the grays, a lot of the darker colors you need to take out so that you just get the image itself of which you, it's hard to explain just the, uh, the dots itself with not a lot around them. So you can't have, you can't, you can't, for instance, uh, take this board and make a pen and ink out of it unless you really took and uh, lightened it up a whole lot. And it'd be difficult to do. But anyway, I can't, I, 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 I really am not going to take some of my older designs and uh, make pen and inks as black and whites. Although I am planning on doing some black and whites again uh, in the future. Um, that was one of the questions I got this week. And we talked about the new design with the mountains, the pier. Uh, another question I got this week was uh, custom designs. Do I do custom designs? And the answer to that is yes, I do do custom designs. And a lady asked me, could I do a custom design of her home? She's got a beautiful home, I'm sure, that she'd like to do in County Cross Stitch, and uh, she'd like to do it for Christmas. Well, well, I, I can't get a design out by Christmas, I can tell you right now. And what I put into a design, and once you get the design, I think you'd find it very difficult to stitch by Christmas. Uh, it's a lot of work in my designs when I put into them. Uh, but what you get with one of my designs is something just like this. Your house or dog, cat, family, grandkids, whatever you want, want me to design with a name. And you'll get a package just like this with the design in it with a all the sheets of DMC colors and everything, just like if you went to the uh, uh, Needlecraft uh, needle, uh, Needlework store and uh, bought one right off the shelf. That would be your particular design. Um, I am doing several of those in the background right now. I'm working on some people that do want them by Christmas. One lady does want them, and she'll get it by Christmas. Uh, don't know if she'll stitch it by Christmas, but she'll get it. And then I have another one I'm working on also. But if anyone's interested in that, um, get in contact with me. I'll be happy to uh, tell you a little bit more in depth about what I do and how I go about it and all of that. So I think uh, that's something uh, she was interested in and you might find interesting also. Um, one other thing I like to go this week is um, uh, people are, any suggestions you might have? Any suggestions anyone has about these videos and what I could do to improve them uh, other than looking better? Um, I'm maybe maybe in my office here, this is what I normally, I've been putting these videos out with the boxes behind me with the rolls of floss, the big things of floss over here and all my charts and everything behind me. But this is a, uh, basically what I've been doing. So it seems like it's working okay. Uh, but any suggestions you might give me, I would appreciate it very, very much. Um, this week, like I say, I haven't been doing much because of the family being, haven't gotten a lot of stitching to, done. Was able to sit in, work a little bit on a new design. But other than that, things have been kind of slow for me. Um, what else have I been doing? Well, I took the... Uh, ice maker out of a freezer in the refrigerator today been working on that and uh, I got that on my workbench in the shed uh, I told the wife I didn't know if I, I'd be able to fix fix it exactly but I take a picture of it and make a cross stitch pattern if that would make her happy probably won't but anyway I thought that's that's one thing I've been working on so but anyway I will keep you informed of morning light uh, next week, I'm going to show you some sketches I've come up with for the new design that I'm going to be working on. And um, until then, as always, I wish each and, one, each and every one of you to have a wonderful week. And again, as always, please be safe. And I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.